What's up, everybody? I am BK, BKBangers.com. Welcome to another video. Today, I want to share with y'all a little, um, I ain't going to say it's a trick, but it's a, it's something that's inside of the, the drum programs or any programs that you have that's called Flatten Tool or Flatten Pad, sorry. And I'm going to show you guys that today. I started to um, cook up this beat and I said, I'm going to utilize this in this beat. So I said, let me cut the camera on and share that with you guys. I got the sample already uh, chopped up. And I'm going to play it real quick. It's kind of fast. I don't know if I'm going to keep that tempo yet. But that's what I was working with. So the thing of it is, is that when you have, sometimes we'll have a drum kit or will have um yeah like a drum kit or expansion pack or something and there'll be a kick on pad a one and there'll be a kick give me one second y'all hello good afternoon all right so that call just threw me off a little bit so i don't know where i was at but i was Somewhere saying if you had a if you had a kick on pad a one and you had a kick on pad a two or a five right so you got you got two kicks on these pads right and you got two kicks on the other two pads a two and a six right and you like kick kick snare snare kick snare right and you got to use four fingers really to to trigger those pads so i could i could um show you better than i could tell you right so let me see so i'm gonna put that one there put this one here and playing it like you know I gotta use two um two fingers and if you look at the waveform let me close this real quick if you look at the waveform the waveforms are different on on each sound so the workaround is right you go into program edit, take it off of all. Whereas you go into program edit, right? And then layer two, layer two would become. Uh, boom layer two will become that and then You'd put layer two, do, 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 you'd add the other layer. So now, so now you have that on as one pad, right? Opposed to having it on two different pads. Then, 
say you like that sound, you could just go ahead and flatten it, flatten the pad to all right. So now I'm I'm going to do it differently. I'm gonna put the same drums on a different pad, which is I want boom. Boom. And then I want and then I want all right. So then, now that you have the kick and the snare on the particular pad that you want it on, you then, inside of your program edit, I'm, I don't remember where it's at in here. To... Edit. So you'd have to go to program, you go to edit, you go to program, and you go to flatten pad, and it pulls up the flatten pad option on the screen. And you're able to rename it whatever you want to, uh, whatever you want to name it. So boom, and then you you could change the tail length to whatever you wanted to change. So part in the darkness, it's a uh, it's a storm brewing where I'm located right now, so it's a little dark. So you'd uh, flatten that pad, you hit do it. So now that's one, that's these two on one pad, right? I'm gonna do the same with this kick. If you have the, your, your MPC Live or MPC X, once you're in the program edit, you're able to just go above and hit the flat, the down arrow, and that's for flatten pad. But in order for you to get it, get to it on in the software, you go to edit, go down to program, and right here where it says flatten pad, you hit that, and it pulls it up. You name it whatever you want to name it hit do it so then now you have brand new sounds pretty much right and then you can also alter it like velocity and the left the sound of the you know you could filter it. You could do all the extra stuff that you want to do to the actual sound. It's a little bit of sound design. I just thought I wanted to share that with you guys because I've been working on some um, some drums and some different sounds within the MPC software. And I didn't have the video on recording that the last time I was doing it. So I said the next time I open up the software... Um, I'm gonna do that. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this little sound design drum flatten um, feature that's inside of the MPC software, and you can make brand new sounds with just that feature alone. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna cook up a little bit of this beat. I don't know how much of it I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave into this video. Um, 
But yeah, man, do remember that music is life. It is our DNA. Keep banging. Peace. Love light. Till next time. Peace. Thank you.